Hey, Dev Nation. Today we're going to be doing an unboxing. We have quite a few mail to go ahead and unravel here. Five different boxes to go ahead and open. So I'm going to be sharing with you guys all the different books recently ordered. So let's go ahead and get started. We got our first book. I think I know which one this one is. I don't know if you can tell on the very front. There's like kind of an orange hue, an orange little circle. Tear at perforation. I don't know. Right there. Okay. I'm stronger than the bag. There we go. Robin Sharma's The 5AM Club. So this is actually for our Valentine's Day giveaway. So order an extra copy. Ah, brand spanking new. Robin Sharma's 5AM Club. Own your morning, elevate your life. Completely fabulous book. Probably one of my favorite, if not my favorite, self-help books. So if you guys are looking for any sort of self-help, you know, personal development sort of books, definitely go ahead and check this one out. And it is going to be going to one lucky one that we'll be announcing later this week. But own your morning, elevate your life. Robin Sharma's The 5 a.m. Club. Super excited to go ahead and share this with someone else. So this is our first book. Let's go ahead and take a look at the next one. Now, I know which, where this is from. This actually made it. Oh, man. The adhesive. Like, this made it all the way out from Iceland. So I actually won this in a giveaway with Underdog Books. Uh, friends over with Mike over there. Thank you, Mike for going ahead and uh, pick me as one of the winners. Thank you, Gunnar Andre, as well, for doing the giveaway and collaborating with Mike as well. Message from the middle of nowhere, Icelandic Viking philosophy for conquering the challenges of business and life. So super excited to go ahead and actually read this book. I'm really into traveling, but I actually haven't gone to Iceland yet. So hopefully I can learn a little bit more about Iceland, you know, Icelandic Viking philosophy, and excited to go ahead and learn about it and use that in business and in life. Let's take a look at back. Straight from Iceland, this book mixes new wisdom with the ancient Viking philosophy. It's a true inspiring story of success and failure, of fighting fire and ice, of the art of sales and successful living. This sounds really cool. I love the cover. It looks mad cool. And I love the binding too. It's like really nice. Really nice book. Feels good in your hands. Who's the publisher? Big Spirit, Magical Stave. I'm not sure. Includes a bonus chapter about quality sales. Pretty cool. So Gunnar Andre Thorison, entrepreneur, professional speaker, best-selling author. Message from the middle of nowhere. Definitely go ahead and uh, check this one out. I'm excited to go ahead and read it real soon. It feels really nice in your hands. It's like, wow, it's really solid. Anyways, book number two of our unboxing. And I love the packaging, really great. It's like sturdy. All right, how do we open this one? This box is made to fit. There we go. Let's rip this. <laughs> okay. So, 12 Rules for Life by Jordan B. Peterson. Now, I'm actually recently a very big fan of his. I actually found him on YouTube. And so, from there, I really got into like, a lot of his lectures and uh, just different subjects that he discusses, uh, mainly being on uh, um, psychology. So I went ahead and ordered his book and actually went ahead and pre-ordered his new book, which I believe should be in one of, one of these uh, next boxes. But Jeremy Peterson, this is uh, one of the first books he wrote. I believe it's actually his second. His first one is like uh, Maps of Meaning or something like that. And I want to actually go ahead and uh, order that one, but I'm going to order that one once I finish these two. Uh, this one, and I'm assuming the next one. Uh, but Jeremy Peterson, 12 Rules for Life, An Antidote to Chaos. The most influential public intellectual in the Western world right now by New York Times. Wow. And wow, just another great, like, feels really nice. I'm glad I got the hardcover copy too. Like, it looks very, like, glossy and shiny. Let's see. So number one international bestseller, Wall Street Journal, Sunday Times, Publishers Weekly, Globe, and Mail, Toronto Star. Super excited to go ahead and read this book. It does look a little beefy. Uh, let's see. It's probably, like, I'd say 400 pages. Ooh, no. It's around 350-ish pages. So there you are. Oh, nice. Pretty cool. So that is Jeremy Peterson's 12 Rules for Life. Just unboxed it and looks cool. Just from like, just the cover alone. It looks really nice. Yeah, actually came in a good condition. I always hate when I order new books and then they get all beat up, you know, getting shipped out to you. And so it's a tragedy. Sometimes I get them like bent up on the corners and whatnot. They came out really nice. Super excited to go ahead and read this one. Next, what do we got? What do we got? I'm hoping it's the second one. 
pulled more rolls of thread. This actually just came out either today or yesterday. No, this came out today because I saw it on, on his Instagram. He was announcing that it actually came out today because I just pre-ordered it. Uh, Jordan B. Peterson's Beyond Order. So it's 12 more rules for life. So I'm super excited to also go ahead and read this one. We live in a time when so many young and not so young people feel lost. Mr. Peterson talks about the attitudes that will help find the path. It's not a politically correct or officially approved path, but it is an intensely practical and yet heightened one. This life you're living has meaning. So yeah, I know definitely with Jordan B. Peterson, he's gotten into a lot of different, he attracts a lot of different crowds and some people like him for it, some people love him for it. I would say I'm more on the love side because it doesn't seem like he's a bad person, right? From all the lectures he talks about, like he's just generally trying to help people. And so, you know, I, I'm always trying to be open-minded with, you know, just anyone around the world and listen to what they have to say. So I think that's always the, the biggest step to like just, learning being open-minded with other people even if they're different opinions whatever from you be open-minded what's the worst that happens you at least get to better understand their point of view even if you don't agree we can have disagreements but still be civil with each other and i mean but though granted jordan peterson i agree on a lot of the things he says so i'm actually super excited to go ahead and read his second book after i read his first one as well and they both look just phenomenal look at that they look gorgeous Twelve Rules for Life and Beyond Order. So that's Jordan B. Peterson. They are thick books. Wait, what do you say? Three fifty. All right. And the last one. Let's see what do we got. I'm trying to think. That's the tricky thing. When you start ordering a lot of books, you kind of forget what books you ordered until you go ahead and like open them. Especially if you order them like in sequence. You're just like, oh yeah, I forgot I ordered that one. Oh, yeah. You see? Oh, yeah. I gotta order this one. <laughs> so I actually ordered the Ryan Holiday set. Uh, the Way, The Enemy, The Key. Ryan Holiday. So this set, actually, you can see it there. This set has the obstacles, the way, ego is the enemy, and stillness is the key. So pretty cool. Boom, you got it right there. Oh, and it has, like, quotes everywhere. Objective judgment now at this very moment. Unselfish action now at this very moment. Willing acceptance now at this very moment of all external events. That is all you need. Or that's all you need. Marcus Aurelius. Super excited to go ahead and read Ryan Holiday's books. I actually just recently also ordered a couple of weeks ago, maybe a week, two weeks ago. Um, what was it? The Boy Who, Bec uh, the Boy Who Became a King, something like that. But it's pretty much about Marcus, or it's supposed to be about Marcus Aurelius and I guess him growing up. I haven't read it yet, so I definitely got to go ahead and read these three additional ones as well. Super excited to go ahead and read it. I've heard a lot of good things about Ryan Holiday as well. He's supposed to be a really great author. And I was like, well, I'm really interested in stoicism and learning all about it. Like I said, being open-minded to this new idea. Um, just from the little that I've like tried to read up on them, just like Wikipedia and Googling. Sounds really cool. They talk about like Memento Mori. So even if you were like this great big person who just one like i don't know i guess back in those times you you're coming back and you're a commander who just won like a big battle and you have like this parade and celebration of your honor they had this person that would actually go ahead and whisper in their ear reminding them memento mori you know you are human therefore you must die so remember this moment because at some point you will die you know so, so to sort of humble you down and remember like we're all just human you know so super excited to go ahead and read ryan holiday's books Stillness is the key, ego is the enemy, and the obstacle is the way. The timeless art of turning trials into triumph. And again, I love, I've, honestly, all these books have been super, super cool. Right here, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven books in total. 5 a.m. Club, Message from the Middle of Nowhere, Beyond Order, 12 Rules for Life. Oh, this is upside down. Bam. Ryan Holiday's stillness is the key. Ego is the enemy and the obstacle is the way. These all look magnificent, just all in their binding. They look great. Super excited to go ahead and read them. And of course, go ahead and share all the super cool concepts and different ideas and quotes with you guys all across different platforms and on our website. 
I hope you guys enjoyed taking a look at our unboxing this week. Please go ahead and let me know which book you guys are most excited to go ahead and perhaps hear about or uh, have me leave a review on. And I'll make sure to go ahead and pretty much try and make that like my next pick of books that I go ahead and read. Um, uh, I honestly don't know which one to read. These all seem so exciting. So yeah, you guys let me know, comment below which one you guys want me to go ahead and read next. And I guess I'll go ahead and read it. Super excited to read all of these, to be honest. So all right, Dev Nation, I hope you guys enjoyed today's book haul. I'm wishing you guys all the best. Continue to persevere and make progress towards your goals. I'm wishing you guys a truly great day. Thanks for watching.